Vandu is going to open community drop-ins for to collect narratives, stories, data on the way that the police behave in Vancouver. On Thursday, members of the Vancouver Area Network of Drug Users announced a new community-led police oversight project, which comes after years of what the group calls high-profile VPD-related deaths and injuries here on Hastings Street. POWER, which stands for Police Oversight with Evidence and Research, is intended for members of the downtown east side to formally report negative experiences with any law enforcement, specifically the Vancouver Police Department. We believe that the lack of accountability and accurate reporting from police, including the harms caused, the, the harms caused, that the community with Van Du had to form the group power. If anybody has interaction with the police, uh, they're not satisfied with that interaction, they feel they have been, um, any of their rights have been violated, we do have a complaint process in place. Um, we also have uh, a large oversight, which we've, we've talked about a lot, the OPCC um, is our, our oversight. Members of Van Du say the community-led research project will collect and analyze interactions with law enforcement in hopes to advance processes of police accountability in Vancouver. From transit cops to park rangers to the VPD, law enforcement perpetuates violence across our communities without any meaningful public accountability. One example cited in Thursday's news conference, a 2022 incident in which a Vancouver police officer hit a pedestrian on East Hastings with his cruiser. Constable Jack Zhao was eventually found guilty of excessive speeding relative to conditions and ordered to pay $2,300. He was initially charged with failing to exercise due care to avoid colliding with a pedestrian and speeding, but those charges were stayed. When we have a problem with cops, who do we have to go report to? Cops. So we used to see cops harass people two at a time. Now we see groups of eight. We see them block out cameras. They avoid accountability. Power organizers say depending on the data and trends that roll in, they'll likely end up compiling academic and community-based reports for evidence. The community drop-ins will be held at Van Du every Wednesday from 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. starting July 10th. Us poor people are just as much human and have just as much a heartbeat than anybody else. In Vancouver, Kate Walker, City News.